Hey guys, welcome back to a new video today. Today we're going to be installing rear spatters for the rear bumper. Let's get right into it. Okay, so these are the rear spatters and I hope these are the ones that should fit on the car because I ordered the same specs as last time. So the reason I'm running it is because I want to complete the whole entire lift kit. So um, obviously, you know, I'm using, using these uh, washers or plastic washers, whatever you guys have. Um, and then it does come with screws. Um, looks as if they're very lengthy and uh, we're gonna get a drill bit for these for sure. And then we're gonna get some 3M tape, of course. This is really tape, so I can stick better and secure better with the screws just in case if these ever fall off. So right now we're just gonna test fit them to see if they fit. Alrighty, so it has um, drill bits uh, implemented. Um, so this is how it's gonna fit and it sits pretty flush for my liking and I really really like it so this is how I'm gonna be putting it on. It's pretty simple. Uh, you put 3M tape right here and then right here and then you screw in in the middle to uh, fully be secure. So let's get right into it and I'll show you guys how to do it. Alright so to install this properly what um, I highly suggest is that you measure the drill bit to the screw size that it comes with. This is the screw that, um, oh, no, actually, no, I'm wrong. Um, these are the screw that it comes with, and um, sadly enough, I prefer to use something different. And um, I suggest that earlier in the video, this is much needed. The washer, plastic or metal washer is fine. So I, I prefer plastic since um, it doesn't rust or anything like that. And then you sh just make sure it fits. So I use this uh, from my old um, all fit lip. So how you do it is that you take this measurement and see oh, how you do it is just do this. Hold on. And the, it's a tad bit bigger. So you gotta get something a lot smaller than these screws, which is ah right here, right here. Just like that. If it's a smaller than the screw, then it will secure uh, for sure, and it won't even come out. So you don't, you guys don't have to use the nuts and bolts for this. Thank you. 